Multi-user programming is a more flexible version of full tracking. This option is not available to the GrenMA Micro. Multi-user programming allows for multiple users to play back and program groups of lights independently while working with the same show file in all the stations. Configuring a multi-user session is identical to configuring a full tracking session. Instead of selecting full tracking in session mode, select multi-user. The big difference between full tracking and multi-user is in the use of worlds. A world limits what a console in the GrenMA range can program and play back. Anything that is not in a console's world will be unaffected by programming actions, such as delete or store. To create a world, you must first open the World Pool window. Select a range of fixtures or channels. Press the Store Hard key and press an Empty World Soft key. You can also create a world that only has certain parameters. Simply select the range of required fixtures and activate the required parameters. To enter a world, press the World Soft key. The fixture and channel sheets will now be restricted to the fixtures and channels that are in the world you have created. If you play back some cues, you will only play back the contents of your world. When two or more consoles are in a multi-user environment, Worlds allow the users to separate areas of responsibility. One console, for example, could control only the conventional channels, whereas the other console could control only the moving lights. If worlds overlap, programming control will be on a latest takes precedence basis. The exec sync soft key determines whether the console will play back executor commands from other consoles. Any console that has a green exec sync soft key and where go is pressed on a queue will trigger a go command for this queue on all consoles that have a green exec sync soft key. The control soft key is used in combination with the exec sync soft key to determine which console in a multi-user environment specifies the state of the executors when returning to sync. It can also be affected by a world that overlaps your current world. A green control soft key means that you have full playback control over the contents of the current world. A yellow control soft key stands for partial playback control over the contents of the current world. To take over control of the current world, press the control soft key. The full soft key returns full control of all channels, fixtures and parameters to your console. Worlds are extremely powerful and have many uses even when not in a multi-user environment. They allow you to reduce the focus of the GrenMA console on a temporary basis without impact on fixtures, channels or parameters outside the scope of the current world.